And now to other stories. Niger State Governor Abubakar Sani Belo has assured that his government will do whatever it can to support the Ministry of Mines and Steel Development to achieve its aim of carrying out Airborne Geoph Geophysical Survey, AGS, in the state. The governor gave the assurance when he played host to a sensitization team on the AGS at the Government House Mina, the state capital. Governor Sani Belo, who described the innovation as great, applauded the ministry, adding that such innovative steps will create opportunity for investors to come into the sector, but pointed that lack of adequate data in the sector might hinder investors. The governor noted that there are some local government areas that are also viable, such as Shiroro, Moya, Mariga, Rijau, Magama and Tafa, that were not covered for the survey. The sensitization team leader and director general, National Steel Raw Materials Exploration Agency, Kaduna, Dr. Maru Albaka Hassan, disclosed that the survey is aimed at acquiring more details on geology and mineral potentials of the selected local government areas, and the exercise will facilitate accurate location of mineral resources and will stimulate investment, leading to increased economic activities in the state to be surveyed as desired by President Muhammad Buhari. We are here the purpose of sensitizing the residents of Niger State. The ministry, through the Moon Diver Project, is embarking on this air bunch of Kosovo excess of, uh, across 19 states of the Federation. And Niger State being one of those states that will be involved in recovering nine local governments in the state. Now, an aircraft will be used to be flown at 50 meters altitude, meaning that it will really fly low. So we are here to sensitize the residents that if they see the aircraft, they should not please panic because it's not something that will harm them. The aim is to help generate geosciences data that's very vital in locating where mineral resources are located in this various local